Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into it. Thank you God for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Virgo, these are the cards that I pulled for love. I, I attempted to do your reading and the camera battery exhausted. So, um, all right, so we got the Ace of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. It seems as if somebody was visiting your home and it might have just, it thought you thought it was going somewhere and you thought that the relationship would progress, um, but it might have just been sex, okay? It could be dealing with a Libra. They have other options. You'd be dealing with anybody, okay? And um, you kind of cut this off and you cut it out you know or this this is what you feel like you should do you're at a place of indecision or if you did cut this person off do know that you know reconciliation is on the table this person does have other options they do think of you they do fantasize about you they do want to come back to you they look at you as the queen of pentacles um and they're all uh you know all in knots about maybe coming back to you and making you fall in love with them again but keep in mind it might just be that they always want to have access to you. As I say that, the Knight of Swords comes out. Look at that. He always wants to have access to you. He wants treating the relationship, treating you like a possession and still being, you know, sneaky, a liar, deceptive, out for this, you know, their own personal gain, coming to get what they can get and, and, and move it on and maybe even leaving you again, holding the bag, the bag of tears, a jar of tears, you know, it's like you know that this because you know this relationship is going nowhere or you have an idea or there's indication of it with the two nights here it definitely lets me know that you're dealing with somebody from the past where there's been it's promise of longevity it could work but there's been a little progression you're like it just doesn't progress you start and you end up like at the same place you're like okay well we started this six months ago we're still you know you're still traveling to me or I'm traveling to you you're getting your you know having fun and then you leave you know when they leave they take the, the power with them with that red cloak on because when they want to come back they'll hit you up and come back and it's like they all have all the power in the connection like you've given up power given up agency of making you know change or making something different happen in this connection it's like it's all on the other person and this could be vice versa also you know virgo could be doing this to somebody um let's see what's going on in career and finance for you virgo career and finance for virgo what do we have for Virgo? All right, so you got three cards coming out. Wow, the Queen of Pentacles. So some of you could be the working mom. You work a lot. You have a business. You have a job. Um, it could be in fashion. It could be in beauty. It could be something holistic. Um, it looks as if um, you're trying to grow something here. You could be trying to bring in different streams of income, Ten of Cups. Um, you're having a lot of fortune after a very difficult time in your life. A friend or, or loved one could come to you wanting to collaborate, wanting to go in partnership. It says look over all paperwork or anything associated with that. You're having your time in the sun here with the, t with the 10 of cups. There could be a lot of travel, or a lot of fun had in the summertime. The two of cups, yeah, you could be uh, proposed with some contract, some partnership again is coming up. Um, where it's mutually beneficial. So someone could wanna go into partnership with you and it's gonna be beneficial for the both of you or this could even be a big, large entity, a corporation wanting to partner with you, you know, on something. And of course it's gonna, it's beneficial. And they're seeking this connection, you know, this one-on-one -on -one connection here. It says, do your due diligence and be proactive again looking over things making sure you're not getting swindled or taking advantage of just because you didn't read or you you weren't abreast to or you you know um the seven wands talks about proactive so be proactive 
But that doesn't mean that this is a no answer in terms of partnership. It just means that protect yourself. It talks about identity theft. It talks about theft. Um, defending what is yours, maybe even clientele. So yeah, this is what I have for you, Virgo. If it resonates for you, go over. This could be some of you switching to another job or another company and they may make you sign some non-compete, non-disclosure type of situation. Or maybe your last job is wondering if you're gonna take clientele or you're gonna take uh, yeah, a level of business with you. So yeah, do your due diligence on that. Um, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can also, um, what else can you do? Oh, so many different things you can do at the website, book a reading. Um, you could donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so. If you took something from the reading, you could give back the buy L a coffee link Buy L a coffee link is below. Um, and today is the new moon. So get in on the new moon, um, money jar manifestation. If you're trying to bring in more money, different streams of income, um, uh, money manifestation, hopes, dreams, wishes, um, you're trying to bring it into fruition, any donation, any amount, uh, donated to the money jar, um, will get your name put in the jar and we're going to do a collective, uh, prayer, uh, tonight and the next three nights to bring in and usher in all of that abundance. Okay. So if you want to get in on that, the link is below. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.